Greetings fellow detectives, Wizard Kitten here bringing you part 3 in our playthrough of The Sojourn. We have just completed the Intimidation level, and I believe we have now completed the second ring of our star here. So let's go ahead and proceed and see what we found. Familiar scenery. So is this like a level that we should be familiar with that we've seen before? Let's see here. Okay, so we need something to help us get across that bridge. I would imagine that we just put it over here, don't we? Then we can walk through, oh, I see. That's why it's kind of tricky. Because we can get through the arch, but then how do we get across the bridge? Is this enough? Oh, that didn't work. <laughs> hmm. Oh, interesting. We need something here to help us get across there. Gosh, I gotta say, this music today is definitely needed. Um, really enjoying it. I'm having one of those days where I'm just kind of feeling crummy, but I don't know why. Do you guys ever get those days? Let me know in the comments if you do. They can be really frustrating, honestly. But this music in this beautiful world here is kind of helping me with that. So, let's see. If I swap here and then go through the arch. swap oh no <laughs> swap here and then maybe go across the bridge that way and then swap again but I don't know I feel like that doesn't really help much um to swap with that. Because I don't think I'm gonna make it across. Oh boy, oh I did. Oh, I did make it across, okay. So I just sort of had to trust. Oh boy, that makes a lot of sense. Trust, not easy. Okay, so now we're on the outer level of the star, beautiful. I love how each level ensemble, okay. How each level kind of assembles itself as you walk out. Oh my gosh, look at that tree. It's so pretty. Do you guys ever get emotional when things get so pretty? <laughs> ensemble, okay. Well, I'm gonna swap with that. And then I need something here. So, oh, I need two. Oh, interesting. And then the harp. Ah, interesting, okay. So I wonder if I can do this and turn to get that one there. Ooh, but then how do I get to the other side? Oh, that's tricky. Swap. And then maybe put it here instead. Yeah. 
and then swap this one. Yeah, there we go. Okay. So the doorway should be open. And I almost have to... Yes. Time it just right. <laughs> nice. Okay. Looking good, looking good. Our next puzzle is... Oh, not a puzzle. Oh. Ooh, it's like a... I don't know what these are called. Oh, what do we have here? The merchant. Okay, and the kid is blindfolded now. The merchant isn't, but the man is like, or is he like a tax collector? She looks very stoic. He's got a little bit of a smile, so he's not upset. Interesting. And the boy is just watching. The child is watching. Very interesting. I wonder what that is supposed to symbolize. Because I feel like we have, like, knowledge we had with the sage. And then the material possessions that we have here with this kind of merchant-type figure. Um... So yeah, I don't know. There's a lot going on here. Also, this is beautiful. And I want to take a picture of it for a potential screenshot. <laughs> okay. Imitation. Mm -hmm. That's how people learn. That's how children and babies learn, is through imitation. So if we're imitating... Oh... They're different. They're, like, doubled. Place a statue in this chamber, chamber to duplicate it in the other one. When you remove one of the statues, the second one disappears with it. I see. So, that's why they're imitating one another. Because there's duplication there. Okay. So, what did that do? When you remove one statue, the other disappears with it. Did they create a bridge for me? How do I get my bridge? Aha! Oh, I see. I don't need a bridge. Because I can just swap over to this side. Via the imitation. I like, too, that message that we, like, imitate our caregivers, so everything we learn about, like, our culture and our, ooh, symmetry, our rules, our traditions, our expectations is all things that we imitate from our caregivers. Oh, that's pretty. What is that? Looks like a plumb bob. <laughs> is this The Sims? So, I'm thinking we go here. And we get the statue and imitate it. So now there's one over there. There's also the ring there. Okay, what if we swap like this? And then... Is it open? Oh no, because it's not closed now. Oh. Oh, interesting. So what about this? Okay, so that's how we get across. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no, am I trapped? Uh oh no, okay, good. It lets me through. That's good. Do I even need to Oh yeah, no, I do need the ring. I see. I can go backwards, but I can't go forwards. Ooh, you clever little bridge, aren't you? Um, well, I need to duplicate it to get there, but then I also think I need it there. So I wonder how this works, because if I put it here...
I need to join the plumb bob. Oh, I gotta sneeze. Oh, it went away. So then... I sort of need to get it back there. Do something like this. Swap. Aha! Swap. There we go, because now it's unlocked and I'm on the right place. Okay. And then we ring. I wish we could run. <laughs> it would make crossing those bridges a lot less stressful. Bewilderment. Oh my gosh, what a great word. Bewilderment when that first moment in life when things don't work out the way that you're, you expect them to work out. Wild times. All right, well, I clearly have to go here. This is the only way I can go. And then I can duplicate our statue. And then I wonder if I can probably go back through here again. Swap this. And make it across here. To then swap this. So now it's unlocked. I am, however, trapped. So that's not ideal. <laughs> Maybe... I'm supposed to duplicate it here. And then swap with that one instead of that one, perhaps? Hmm. Swap. No, because then I run into the same issue, don't I? Where I'm on the wrong side. So maybe I'm supposed to swap with this one. Swap. Ah. Swap. Ring. There we go. I'm starting to get the hang of this. And now the second that I've said that, this next level is going to be so much harder. <laughs> I'm always so afraid of jinxing myself when things are going well. The overlook. Mm. So kind of examining things around us. Okay, so if we're supposed to overlook something, we have our one statue here. And we can go this way. We have another statue here. So if we overlook that way. Hmm. Oh, and then there's a bridge. Huh. Which I sort of feel like maybe that one goes there? That one goes there. But I was able to cross before, so maybe that's not right. Swap. Hmm. But if I overlook... So I'm supposed to get one here. Can I get up there? I don't think there's a way for me to get up there. What am I overlooking? That hardly seems right. Worth 
shot. Let's see. Well... I think it's interesting that we can go this way, but we can't go this way. So what am I missing that could be kind of crucially important for that location? Like if I put something here, there was one here. There was also one over there. Can I put one up there? No. I can't swap with anything up there. Hmm. Whoa. That was so close. So what is the point of having one over there? being able to cross this bridge besides maybe resetting what does this allow me to do that I couldn't otherwise be great if I could put one here so maybe I have to swap one here and then up here let's try that let's before we even do this I swap and then I swap one down here so then I can swap like this to have enough energy to get up here and swap this so then it overlooks or at least from here I have enough space conceivably possibly um what if I put it here? And then what if I go like here? Swap and swap. And then we can cross because now there's one on the pedestal. There we go. Victory is mine. Okay. I'm super curious to see what happens when we get this star filled in. Eagerness. I am so eager right now. Yes, game. <laughs> you get me. Okay, so this is a duplicator with that one. This is one that we need open. So... I guess let's just start trying some things out here. Can I... Make it to here and swap. And then, I mean, I could swap with this, but then I don't think there's any more magic over on this side. There's also the ring and we need that closed. So definitely more to the story here. There's this. So I think I need to duplicate and then move one onto here. Let's try that. Unless we do this part first. Hmm, that doesn't seem to make much sense, does it? Maybe it does. And I'll go over here to duplicate it.
and then I can swap this. But then I run out of energy to be able to do the bell. So the gate is open. Hmm. But I'm like just out of energy. It's very close. And I can't quite see the bell from here. So... I don't want to swap here, do I? No, I don't think I do. I think I want to go here. And then swap like this. And then swap like this. But that's what I did before, and it doesn't work. Yeah, it's, I don't have enough energy to make it around the corner. So I guess the other option is to try what I just thought wouldn't work, where I swap it with the energy here. To recoup at some point. So swap like this. How do I make it anywhere? Uh, I don't, I think. That doesn't make any sense to me, because I would swap here to recover energy that I definitely don't need. here and swap like that but no that's basically the same problem sing oh do I sing and then swap oh I bet I swing and then s swing I bet I sing and then swap because I have just enough energy to see it before I swap okay yeah, because I can totally reach the ring. Okay, so let's do this. I go here. I say, ring, swap. There we go. Teamwork makes the dream work. And what do we have now that our star is complete? Let's find out. Is it, oh, it's the king or the knight. The parents look tentative, but proud. And the knight is kind of initiating the boy or praising the boy. There's something going on here. And I don't exactly know what, but I think we are going to continue our journey through the door in the next video and perhaps there we will find out more thank you so much for watching fellow detectives i hope that you enjoyed this part of our playthrough of the sojourn please feel free to like comment subscribe and hit that notification bell for more nancy drew sims 4 and the sojourn content thank you so much for watching fellow detectives i will see you soon